Hello everyone, I am Yash Patel and welcome to my channel Django World. So in today's video, we are going to see widgets in Django Forms. Now we have been using widgets since uh, the first video, right? The first video of the Django Forms. And you know very well that how we can use widgets. So here, the attribute which is known as widget only. Inside this, we provide all type of widgets to our input field, which is over here. Okay. Now, but in this video, I would like to explain this in a more detail. Okay. So here, see, whenever we write this Python code to create this type of HTML input field, how it basically converts, it has a basic uh, in, inbuilt API in the Django, which convert the Python code to HTML right but wh whenever we pass the widget to the particular field it is something like this see here the moment you write emp name equals to forms dot character field it will basically create input field and at that moment okay after that you will provide the maximum length which is max length the label the required field okay all these known as widgets now inside this we can pass the class so here you will see the class okay now if you want to provide the type of the particular input field then you can say type hyphen password okay now it will be become password input field see the character has been converted into the dots okay like this you can play with the widgets these are very common widget if you know the HTML very well at that time you will understand how the widgets are used in it here you can also you know modify this one you can say text enter now this will be text field you can see right but this is not a permanent change okay here this is console you can just debug the code you cannot make permanent change in the code right for that you need to debug play with this thing and come over here and modify the changes okay all right so like this was the basic fund to create the video for which it's especially right so yeah i think this is it so if you want to do this date build then you can just do date just refresh over here and this will be date input field you can see this uh, small icon which pop ups the calendar like this you can play with it okay so yeah this is it for today's video guys if you like my video please like share and subscribe to my channel and this was the widget this is uh, there is nothing special thing like there is nothing more important in the widget it is simple widgets which we use in the html you can use same thing over here but you need to pass this in a dictionary key and a value format okay so here the type this i wrote this one this is key and the value of this key is date okay this is how we basically pass the widgets okay so yeah this is it for today's video guys if you like my video please like share and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in next one thank you